power for progress electrifying rural India. Bringing electricity to rural areas is a transformative step towards progress and development. Electricity is important for agriculture. It powers irrigation systems, ensuring that crops receive the water they need to thrive. It helps farmers use modern tools. With electric tractors and other equipment, farming becomes more efficient and productive. This means they can grow more food, higher yields lead to better food security and increased income for farmers. Power helps store food and get it to markets. Refrigeration units keep produce fresh, reducing waste and ensuring that food reaches consumers in good condition. When we bring electricity to rural areas, we help farmers prosper. Streetlights improve safety and quality of life, making villages more vibrant and connected. This essay will talk about the challenges of bringing power to rural India. From difficult terrains to financial constraints, the journey is not easy. It will also talk about the solutions. Renewable energy sources like solar power offer sustainable ways to electrify remote areas. We will learn about places like Marathwada in Maharashtra. This region has seen both the struggles and successes of rural electrification. This region shows us both the problems and the potential. By addressing these issues, we can unlock immense agricultural potential. By understanding these, we can help all of rural India. Together, we can create a brighter, more prosperous future for everyone. The current landscape challenges in rural electrification. Bringing electricity to rural India is hard. Many villages still rely on kerosene lamps for light, which is neither efficient nor safe. There are many reasons why. One reason is infrastructure. The existing power lines are often broken or outdated, making it difficult to maintain a consistent supply of electricity. We need more power lines and substations. Another reason is geography. The diverse and often rugged terrain of rural India makes it challenging to lay down new infrastructure. Some places are hard to reach. Villages located in mountainous regions or dense forests are particularly difficult to access, complicating the electrification process. Money is also a problem. Funding for these projects is often limited and the cost of building new power systems can be prohibitive. Building new power systems costs a lot. Technical challenges also exist. The technology required to transmit electricity over long distances is expensive and complex. We lose a lot of power when we send it over long distances. This inefficiency makes it even more difficult to provide reliable electricity to remote areas. Finally, many people don't understand how to use electricity efficiently. Lack of education on this topic leads to misuse and wastage of power. They need to learn how to save power. Educational programs and awareness campaigns are essential to teach villagers the importance of energy conservation. Bridging the gap infrastructure and geographical challenges. We need to build more power lines to connect villages to the grid. This will bring reliable electricity to everyone. Some areas are remote and difficult to access. We need to find creative solutions to reach these communities. This might involve using off-grid solutions like solar power. We also need to make sure the power lines can handle bad weather. By overcoming these hurdles, we can bring the benefits of electricity to all. Section 4, Financial Sustainability and Tackling Technical Losses. Building new power infrastructure requires a lot of money. The government should work with private companies. This will help share the costs. We also need to reduce technical losses. A lot of electricity is wasted when we send it over long distances. We can use better technology to reduce these losses. This will make the whole system more efficient. When we save electricity, we also save money. This is good for everyone. Section 5. Empowering farmers' knowledge and efficient energy use. Farmers need to learn how to use electricity efficiently. They can use energy-saving devices. They can also learn better farming practices. This will help them save money on their electricity bills. They can also reduce their impact on the environment. The government can organise training programmes for farmers. They can also provide subsidies for energy-efficient appliances. When farmers have the knowledge and tools, they can thrive. Section 6. A Brighter Future. Transforming Agriculture Through Electrification. 
electrifying rural India will transform agriculture in unprecedented ways. With access to reliable electricity, farmers will be able to grow more food, ensuring a steady supply of crops throughout the year. They can also sell their produce for a better price, reaching markets that were previously inaccessible. This will improve their lives and the lives of everyone in India, providing better education and opportunities for the next generation. Reliable electricity means better irrigation systems, which are crucial for maintaining crop health and increasing yields. It also means using modern machinery, which can significantly reduce labour and increase efficiency. Farmers can store their crops safely, reducing waste and ensuring that their hard work does not go to waste. Electrification is an investment in the future of India, fostering innovation and sustainable development in rural areas. It will empower rural communities, strengthen the nation and pave the way for a brighter, more prosperous future for all.